Hello, this is JC Santana coming to you from the Institute of Human Performance here in sunny South Florida. I want to talk to you about a very, very hot topic, which is functional training, but it's actually a topic within a topic. Everybody talks about functional training, what it is, what it's not. You hear about um, uh, we train movements, not muscles, which is a good start. But a lot of individuals mistake balance training for functional training. In other words, when you say, oh yeah, you do functional training. Yeah, I do functional training. I do the balance stuff and the ball stuff and all that other stuff. It's always unstabilized um, environments coming from the proprioceptively enriched phrase. Let's talk about balance versus stability versus function. And once you understand that, you get a better feel of what functional training is. Functional training is about movement. What does movement do? Movement transfers energy. Whether it's picking up a kid, you're transferring energy from the ground to the kid. That's how the kid comes up, right? You're transferring energy from the ground to a bat, from a ground to a golf club, from a ground through a punch to an opponent. It's always about transfer. So think of this, if you have an island here, which is the ground, and you have an island here, which is an implement, okay, you want to create a bridge. What kind of bridge would you put for yourself if you wanted to go from here to here? If you have one of those little rope bridges with the wooden slats, okay, how much energy could you transfer? Not very much. What I want is I want a stiff bridge made out of iron, made out of cement, at least out of wood, so I can transfer a lot of energy, okay? This is the ground, this is the implement, this is the body, that's the core. Think of that, stiff core, which brings the subject of balance and stability. Stiff core transfer. Would you want to be this pyramid or that pyramid? Which one is capable of sustaining and transferring more forces? Of course this one. This one is stable and balanced by definition. This one is balanced, not very stable. You put forces here or here, this thing is toppling over. This one can take forces from any direction and transfer. Got it? All right. So stability is the name of the game. So when people tell you, I do functional training, I do, oh, I stand on BOSU balls and the Arex pad and all that stuff, I do a lot of balance and proprioceptive training, ask them, what does all that mean? How do you develop, okay, balance and transfer at the same time? Let me show you what I mean.